Hey guys, so today I'm going to create this look right here. This is the easiest everyday go-to makeup look. So let's begin. I'm just spritzing the pack everyday makeup spray on my face just to give my face a nice base before starting on with the makeup. And yes, I'm just taking my beauty blender to blend the sp spray, sorry, the spray on my face just to set it down or settle it down. And then taking the primer, Maybelline One Day Primer, I'm just spritzing, sorry, I'm just dropping it down my face and then I will blend it with my hands. Make sure you do not push the primer, you just blend it and take your time to do this. And do not forget your neck area. And we're almost done. Taking the L'Oreal True Match Foundation, I'll just take a pump of it and that will just do. Yeah, this much. And then I will apply it over all my face. Just in short strokes. Yeah. And then taking my same beauty be I'm sorry. And then taking my same beauty blender, I will just blend it all over my face. Just the usual. And then moving on to the Kiss Beauty Concealer and Contour Palette, I will just take a similar tone concealer shade and then apply it in my under eye area to just make it look fresh and of course to hide my dark circles. I'm also applying it on the upper area, lid area of my eye just to give it a base because we are going to apply eyeshadow later on. Yes, just like that. As this is a cream concealer, this is going to take time, so give it some time. And I am also applying it around my mouth area, just to cut off any kind of pigmentation. And then take your time to blend this, because this is a cream concealer. Yes, every good thing takes time. And then just dab dab and dab and then taking the Maybelline compact super fresh compact I'm going to take my powder brush and then I will just powder the concealed area I'm not baking I'm just powdering it just like that just so it does not crease you know it right And then taking this liquid lipstick, yes, we are going to use this lipstick today for contouring. Just look what happens. It's going to work like magic. And then just the usual, I'm just creating my fake cheekbone line in the hollows of my cheeks. And then just the nose and the jaw, and the jawline, yes, just to hide my double chin. Never mind. And then time to hide my big forehead. And then the usual. Just take the beauty blender and blend. As is a liquid lipstick, just be careful. You do not splurge it all over your face. Just take your time. And yes, can you see the soft brownish cheekbone look that it is giving? It gives the look, the fake look that you actually have a cheekbone. So it is great.
and then just blend the usual. Take your time in doing this step. And then taking the Gigi Hadid brow pencil, I'll just fill in my brows. Now as this is an everyday look, we do not need to create those sharp edgy brows. We just need the fill in part. That will give the brow a nice look. So yeah, just the thick brows. Like Deepika Padukone, sorry. And then some eye tie. I will just take a shiny sort of shade from the LA Colors Girl palette and then I will just give a healthy glow to the upper lid area just so it looks like healthy. I didn't do anything but still it's glowing. And then time to define my crease a bit with the lightest brown color and then more glam. I need more glam. Yes. And applying it with finger just gives more pigmentation and then just balancing the my lower lash line with the same lightest brown color. And yes, just taking the similar shiny shade from the same palette that was tough, you know, tongue twister sort of, I am just highlighting my cheek area. As this is an everyday look, we cannot use harsh highlight. That's why I'm using a highlight shade from this palette and just the usual highlight game. And then taking the faces, kajal or coal, whatever you want to say. I'm just tight lining my eye areas. Now this can be a hard step for the beginners, but just practice it. It will become perfect. And yes, this makes your eyes look filled in and just give the black you know just that sort of eyes and then taking the colossal mascara and just winging out my lashes it's just like that and also do not forget to apply it on your lower lashes too because they also require some sort of definition and then the leftover mascara i'm using to fill in my brows this is a great hack and then taking the Lakme 925 liquid lipstick, matte lipstick, liquid matte lipstick, I'll just fill in my lips. And oh, my immunity, you can see, right? And we are done, and I'm going to take the same lipstick and use it as a blush. No surprise. And yeah, this helps you getting the flushy cheeks you dreamt of. And then taking the beauty blender, I'll just dab it down to settle down the product. And yeah, we are done. If you have liked this video, please do not forget to like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. Bye.